I don't know that there's ever an end to the green revolution, really. Uh, green has a lot of meanings for different people. Um, the, the, the original sense is about feeding uh, our community, feeding ourselves. Can Africa feed itself is the question. And we know that yes. Can it? Yes. How will it? Uh, how will the food move? How will that food actually uh, be available? How will farmers, farming families, rural communities have choices about what they eat and when they eat it? And, uh, so I think that um, uh, the, the, the Green Revolution in Europe has now taken the form of uh, green for um, recyclable and circular economy and climate adaptation. Uh, so it's taken on all kinds of interesting diversified meanings and so uh, a Green Revolution Forum still has uh, so much to offer to so many people. I'm a huge uh, believer in, um, in youth, in, in innovation, in the power of coalitions and alliances. I've really had the experience over the years of the unification of messaging, of one voice, of delivering um, uh, coordinated and actionable recommendations, whether they be to individual governments or even to markets, to be able to say, we together, whether we're a cooperative of 100,000 farmers um, or whether we're uh, an association of businesses or um, whether we're uh, a community of communities, uh, for example, the, the different regions, uh, sub-regions, and, and, and the ability um, to, to actually target and deliver key messages to the audiences and, and mobilize resources is actually what transforms very, very quickly um, from uh, uh, conflict zones to productive zones. And so, um, and, and there are so many examples of that.